Charlie Atkinson from Aussie Road Tripper. We're just outside of Beachport, which is a sleepy little town on the South Australian coast, just south of Rogue. It's a very scenic section of the coastline around here and there's some great ways you can explore it by four-wheel drive or hiking along the cliff tops. It's a great spot. Beachport's jetty is the second longest in South Australia, a whopping 772 metre long. Just out of town is the Pool of Siloam, which is seven times saltier than sea. I reckon this will cure just about everything or anything that ails you, but I'm not so sure about that, but it's pretty floaty. The Bowman Scenic Drive on the edge of town is one of my favourite drives in South Australia. It'll only take you about 10 minutes to do, but there's lots of lookouts and some great fishing spots on the way. We're about to head on to the beach, uh, just north of Beachport, to drive all the way up to Road. Uh, the locals reckon the sand is very soft here and they advise 15 to 20 PSI for your tyres. So I'll let ours down to about 18 or 19 and we'll see how we go from there. It's an exciting trip, but pretty challenging. Make sure you've got some recovery gear and preferably travel with someone else as well. Uh, this looks like a bit of a hairy old sand hill, so we're going to engage the rear diff locker just to give us maximum grip so we can get over. Nailed it! An under national park is on the southern side of Beachport and has seen great hiking trails like the four hour sea view hike. This is an Aboriginal living, I see plenty of those. The national park's not far from the crayfishing village of South End. At $90 a kilo for fresh lobster, these guys were pretty happy with their catch. Beyond the beaches are a string of coastal lakes which are a haven for bird life, especially early in the morning and late in the afternoon. 